Hopkins, and they cross the line. Hell! It's hell by 6,000 for the second. It was one of the most exciting races at Brands Hatch ever. Now Tommy Hill from Linkfield's victory has made it to the big screen. Neil, I understand you've got some details of how a champion <laughs> superbike rider from the South East set to become a big star. Well, you certainly hope so. Tommy Hill from Linkfield picked up the British Superbike title last October after the most thrilling race ever seen at Brands Hatch. And now we can all relive his exploits in the film I, Superbiker, which opens at 120 cinemas next month and charts the drama of an extraordinary championships. You may have never been to or even seen bike racing, but iSuperbiker will still grab you. Oh, the film charts the highs and lows of last season and its epic finale. And now goes Tommy Hill. He tried to make a move through it, through it. For local hero Tommy Hill, it was the opportunity to put the pain and disappointment of 2010 behind him. There's a lot of knockbacks in, in any sport or any industry, and um, I've had my fair share of that, where it's busted bones and losing parts of my internal body and losing kidneys and spleens and stuff. And to finally get it is, is a dream come true. The last corner, Jack of it, come for head down now towards Clearway. And John Hopkins moved over to try and get a tight line. He did this to Tommy last time out. A six month long season came down to the last lap of the last race at a packed Brands Hatch with tens of thousands watching and waiting. And they cross the line. He had to win. It, you know, it, it just had to win. I mean, this this stand here, that's in the film, was basically the Tommy Hill fan club. Flags, or the Tommy. I mean, that must do you so much good when you're sat here on your bike about to take off and you see the, you know, the unofficial Kent fan club. It was fantastic. The story is so gripping that Tommy Hill says there are those that find it difficult to tell fact from fiction. Is there a makeup artist that puts them holes in your arms and scars on your arms? No, they're all real. You know, this is part of motorcycle racing and uh, it's full of ups and downs and I'm not an actor. Um, I'm a motorcycle racer and this is what the, what the film shows. So uh, if you see some gruesome scars and bits of skin hanging off, that's me. It's not a special makeup artist. With a cinema release around the country, Tommy Hill's remarkable story could inspire an audience well beyond his already huge army of fans.